So I just wanted to do a quick um, just example of how the iPad can be used for doing client sketches. I'm holding the camera in my left hand and trying to draw with my right, so I apologize if it's not the best quality as far as video goes. But this is, um, you know, my iPad here, and it's uh, got a bunch of apps here, as you can see, and this is my sketchbook app. And I have a stylus here that I bought at the Apple Store, so I don't have to use my finger. It's a little bit like using a pen. So um, the first thing I'll do is choose what type of brush and everything I want to use. I usually just use the pencil brush and kind of like a black. And this gives you all directions of how to, to use these tools when you first buy this app. So don't worry about like, oh, I don't know how you do that. But um, I would say, oh, do you want a round cake or square cake? How many tiers? And say, oh, I'd like a around three tier cake. I'd say okay and draw that out real quick. It's very much just like using a regular pen or anything. And then um, they might say uh, our colors are blue. And I say, well what kind of blue? Is it a is it a cornflower blue? Is it a is it a sky blue? And and this way you can get like a color a color accuracy pretty fast. And then I might make the uh, thickness of my line a little bit thicker so that I can cover more. And then I might use uh, that to show, is this what you mean as far as the blue goes? And I'll go, yeah, that's, that's the blue that I mean. And you don't accidentally um, make some kind of blue that's, I'm doing this really fast by the way. I would spend more time doing this if I weren't on a time limit. <laughs> but. Um, this really like stops you from accidentally doing the wrong color blue and it also kind of puts their mind at ease so that they uh, they know what kind of blue you're talking about and um, so then I might go back to a smaller line for detail work because they say oh I want some um, I want some bows here Like so, maybe maybe a triple bow here. Like that. And um, and then maybe they want some quilting on the bottom tier. And this is a good way for for you to show your um, your client right away that you're creative and that you can do what they want. Uh, and they can have confidence and instead of saying, well, I think I have an idea of what you want. And they think, do, do you have an idea? Oh, you can also zoom in like really far and do some details, like little dots, and then zoom back out. And then um, maybe you want to clean things up. So you go to, uh, I think this is the erase. Yeah, the erase tool here and maybe clean up some of these little lines here. Um, this is usually, the cleanup is usually what I do later. I don't, need to, I don't need to clean up the sketch in front of the clients, but it just is for your benefit to see that. And then um, you can uh, save this and save this to your iPad and then you can um, open it back up in the gallery and work on it more later and um, then you can actually like uh, email this to yourself or to whoever you want and um, send it to your client once you get it cleaned up and everything so um, yeah that's just a that's just a quick example of what what an iPad can do for uh, cake decorators I use it a lot I, I really enjoy it. I think that it's um, a really valuable tool as far as uh, using with, um, oops, helps if you use the right brush. Um, I think it's a valuable tool as far as uh, cake decorating goes and uh, I use it a lot. Oh, e e there is an undo tool. <laughs> I do use that one a lot too. And. Um, there's just tons and tons of things you can do with this uh, application that I'm not really showing you. Um, 
and there's tutor tutorials online that can show you kind of the extent of of what can really be done with this program but it really has a lot of uh, really a lot of possibilities and um, oops that's not what I want to do um, this is very hard to do while talking <laughs> I don't know how Edna does this <laughs> okay so maybe put some shadow in here give it a little bit of depth Okay. So anyways, this is this is kind of a, a quick example of how you can use an iPad. Uh, again, the program is a Sketchbook Pro and it's a very good program, has a lot of features and options. Um, there's a lot of different tools, a lot of uh, presets and things that they have on here for different types of effects. Um, like, uh, you know, this, this uh, cross hatching and I think they have a uh, Oops, gosh darn it. They have uh, ones that have like leaves and um, really silly ones, you know, like eyeballs. It, it, let's do eyeball brooches. <laughs> okay, so anyways, um, I think that's a good example and uh, I hope this was helpful for you.